certain Hughes wasn't going to give up possession. Spencer. Hughes setting himself. Oh, Lukic lost it completely. And Mark Hughes gives Chelsea the lead. Well, you can rely on him to make a good volley contact. Unfortunately, Leeds could not rely on their goalkeeper. It's a free kick to Chelsea. It's uh, about 18 yards out, but it's to the right of the, Chelsea, of the Liverpool penalty area. It's Di Matteo standing over the ball. He'll knock it in. Chavez going up there. Poyer, of course. Dubry comes out of the far post. That goes Dubry. Gets a helmet for the wrong one. A fantastic shot by Hughes. Yes! What a goal by what Mark Hughes. <laughs> oh, spectacular bicycle kick from the edge of the six-yard area. Mark Hughes scores his ninth Premiership goal of the season, a contender for goal of the season. Yeah, I think. Fantastic. That's typical use. He's been, again, I keep going, he's been doing it all his career. I mean, overhead kicks. We see uh, Carboni do one last week. Um, it's very much a trait of the uh, foreigners that come over here. But Mark Hughes has got his own, uh, own skill and uh, he's been always been good at that. And uh, a fantastic finish. We had no right to get the ball in the goal from that sort of angle. And uh, Fred Friedel again, no chance. Lampard. Decisive run from Lampard. Good Johnson! Oh, that's fantastic! That is a fantastic goal. Ivan Good Johnson brings Chelsea level. Absolutely brilliant. Well, it was decent play from Lampard, who cut through Leeds initially, but even so, the finish was extra special. On the penalty spot. And the technique involved to do that, extraordinary. Too often has gone astray, here's Deco, with a bit of space to operate in here for Chelsea. Unselfish layoff to Balak, should be 2-0 from Kalou, good save by Jaskalainen. Still the danger is there, the overhead kick, fabulous goal, absolutely brilliant, that's what Deco can do. And Chelsea have doubled their money, looked like the chance had gone. But they are now in the comfort zone. What a goal. Absolutely brilliant by Deco. Great contact on the ball. No chance for Jeske Leinen. Well, he's going to ask some questions about his defenders and about the tight marking that should have been there. It was very, very loose. But what a finish by Deco. Call the number 15. And it's in. Brilliantly turned in by Anelka. An equalising goal. The overhead kick means that Watford's lead lasted just six minutes. Nicholas Anelka's equaliser, hugely important as he ties it up at 1 1. Well, this time it fell for him. It's a great finish with his left foot, Anelka. He just puts his left foot around it, knows where the goal is, top class striker. You can't say Chelsea haven't deserved a, a, a goal tonight. Matter is 100%. He's certainly not had the influence he usually does. Now he's going to prove me wrong by finding Denver Bar. Well, there you go. How's that for influence? It's a wonderful goal from Bar. It was created majestically by Matter. Bar still have plenty to do, mind you, but didn't he do it sensationally well? Volleyed the ball over David De Gea, and a game which has been bereft of quality is illuminated by a moment of it from Juan Mata and Denver Bar and Chelsea lead Manchester United by a goal to nil. What a finish, this is absolutely exquisite by Denver Bar. Good running off the ball, we said that people hadn't broken the back line in the first half. He gets in behind and it's a super finish. Good ball for Oscar. Bobby's back, here's Ivanovic, and still, Branislav Ivanovic, charged down, Costa! 2-2! Two -two. Right in front of the Chelsea fans, Costa at the double, and that is the least the Blues deserve. This brilliant game has another twist. Terrific overhead kick by Diego Costa. No more than what that guy's deserved today.